The R14 was a New York City subway car model built by the American Car and Foundry Company in 1949. The cars were a follow-up or supplemental stock for the A Division's R12S and look exactly the same, differing only in floor patterns. A total of 150 cars were built, arranged as single units. Two versions were manufactured, Westinghouse, WH, powered cars and General Electric, GE, powered cars. Delivery of the cars began in August 1949. The first R14S entered service on the 7 IRT Flushing Line in September 1949. All 150 cars were delivered by January 1950. The R14S ran on the Flushing Line until the arrival of the R33 single units and R36 World's Fairs in late 1963, early 1964. The R14S were then transferred to operate on other A-Division routes before being retired and replaced by the R62S in the mid-1980s. Cars 5803 to 5806 were briefly assigned to 3rd Avenue L service in the Bronx to augment the fleet of the GAE R12s. When the 3rd Avenue L service ended in April 1973, the four cars were returned to mainline service. The last R14 ran on December 10, 1984. All but two cars have since been taken off property to be scrapped. Several cars lasted as training vehicles or work cars for many years. For example, 11 R14s were converted into R71 rider cars after retirement but were ultimately replaced with our 161S, our 33S converted into rider cars, and subsequently reefed in 2009. Two cars were retained for various purposes throughout the New York City subway system, including 5871, renumbered to 85871 and later to 35871, being held for the New York Transit Museum. This car was formerly used for fire training. The car retains its MTA blue-slash-silver livery paint scheme, 5, and has been stored at 207th Street Yard for many years. 5944, converted to our 71 de-icer car, RD340. Since the reefing of the R71 rider cars, RD340 is the last surviving R14 work car still in service. Bye! Guys, see you next. Time.